According to a new report, Dan Lin will not be the future president of DC Films and Television after all. On August 27th of this year, we reported that producer Dan Lin was in talks to head up DC Films and Television. This news came right in the middle of Warner Brothers Discovery's reshuffling, and shortly after reports surfaced that current president Walter Hamada almost quit after the cancellation of Batgirl. Things have been looking bleak for Warner Brothers Discovery as of late, and it doesn't appear that things are going to get better anytime soon. Warner Brothers Discovery is currently going through some significant changes, and DC Films is suffering from it. Deadline is reporting that Dan Lin will not lead DC Films into the future. Some reports indicate that Lin rejected the offer from Warner Brothers Discovery, while others say that it went down a different way. For now, Lin is staying with his rideback company. Reports also say that Warner Brothers Discovery is still looking for a big name to fill the top slot at DC Films. We don't know who that is and what that looks like, but we'll likely get some reports in the near future. I personally don't think this is a bad thing at all. I understand that Lin has a strong history of producing some Lego films, but is that truly enough to head up DC Films and compare him to Kevin Feige? I honestly want someone who has at least worked around a legit live action or animated comic book film to be involved here or Bruce Tim. If DC would just do the right thing and get Bruce Tim to be their Dave Filoni, then I'd be thrilled. If they team Bruce Tim up with experienced directors like the Russo brothers, then I'll be really excited. DC needs to do something to make a big wave with a recognizable and trusted figure and then they'll win us over. Anyway, that's all I have for this one. As usual, if you guys like these updates, you want to see more, please do me a favor, hit that like button. Make sure you subscribe. Otherwise, I'm going to check you guys later. Peace.